All right, we just got done building our wood splitter here, and uh, we drug it out. Kind of do a video here. As you can see, we've been splitting this really old deciduous wood. It's been laying around quite a while, dry but deciduous. Lots of knots, really. Anyway, it's a really simple design. Get a big heavy head here. About 100 pounds is ideal. And uh, really simple. There's not a lot to it. It's not a new design. You can see them around. But, uh, you know, it doesn't take any electricity to run this. No gas. No hydraulic hoses. No carburetors. Electri electrical wires. Anything like that that can get chewed up or gum up or break and leak everywhere. And kind of run this at night if you wanted to next to your neighbor's cabin. It really wouldn't bother them. You got a car spring here. A jack down there you can lower and raise the head. Really simple design. And this thing's going to work no matter what. Grid goes out, EMP, whatever, doesn't matter. As long as you can eat your soup, this is going to work. So it's really easy. We're going to have a nine year old little girl chop it. Let's get over here and chop this wood. There it goes. If you're a little bit larger, normal human size, <laughs> not nine years old, you can pretty much do it with one whack. There it goes. You can do a quarter wood with this and your back won't hurt you. You can sit down on a bucket. You don't have to swing an axe all day long. It hits the same spot every time. Just an incredibly neat little device, except by your woodshed. So, how hard was it? Not hard. All right. Think you could split a whole cord with it? Mm-hmm. One more little split here. There you go. Split. Good job. All right, leave your comments below if you like, dislike, and uh, hit the subscribe button. Lots more off-grid solutions coming.